Phuket Extra is brought to you by Coast Beach Club and Bistro at Centara Grand Beach Resort. Chill in the sun, sip under the stars. So the club and welcome to Phuket Extra, brought to you by Coast Beach Club and Bistro at Centara Grand Beach Resort Phuket. I'm JP Mastanta, and here's the news you need to know. A beach food vendor is recovering at a Phuket hospital after he was shot while riding in the back of another motorbike near the airport yesterday morning. The 23-year-old victim was shot in his lower left torso, the bullet exiting near his genitals. Police do know that he was shot when another motorbike pulled up alongside and a passenger pulled the trigger. Police are now looking for the two suspects. And don't mess with the illegal coffee police in Patumtani. Seven people unfortunately didn't take that advice and are now in custody for running an illegal coffee making plant at a warehouse in the central province. The gang would rake in about 2 million baht from making fake packets of Nescafe 3-in-1 instant coffees. Police not only seized 89,000 packets of fake 3-in-1 Nescafes, but also 280,000 empty packets and eight machines. A local tipped police off to the scam and now all seven people face six months to 10 years in jail and a fine of up to 100,000 baht. And now there's a defamation lawsuit coming out of the pricey flight that 38 officials took last week to Hawaii at a taxpayer cost of about 20.9 million baht. Thai Airways is suing a Thai website for releasing a so-called list of people alleged to have been on the flight alongside Deputy Prime Minister Prawit Wong Sawang. Officials within the government have been scrambling to justify the 20.9 million baht cost of taking a charter flight to Hawaii to attend an official meeting with the U.S. Still, a spokesman for the regime said that the flight was within regulations and the 600,000 baht bill for food and drink well, that was just an estimate. And sit tight, Phuket Extra. I'll be right back after this. Satri Phuket School International Program, complete with Cambridge International Examinations, prepares students for life, helping them develop an informed curiosity and a lasting passion for learning. Get into wakeboarding with Wild Wave, based at Royal Phuket Marina. Wakeboarding, wake surfing, and even kneeboarding. Here's a full range of packages for everyone. Wild-wake.com. Welcome back to Phuket Extra. A serial killer is on the loose in Patum Thani as police say three homeless people were found dead in the past three days, all in a similar manner. The latest victim was found yesterday morning outside a drug rehab center with his wrists tied together, his throat slashed, and stab wounds all over his body. The two other victims were found just the day before on Tuesday, also near the same rehab center with their wrists tied up, though one was female with cuts on her chest, and police are now investigating. And Thailand's fruit and vegetable contamination problem is back in the news as the advocacy group Thai Pesticide Alert Network, known as Taipan, are sounding the alarm on over 158 samples that they've tested. Other samples were taken from popular wholesale markets in Nakhon Patom, Ratchaburi, and Patum Thani, saying 70% of the produce from supermarkets were contaminated with pesticide residue. Chinese kale is the most contaminated vegetable, with 10 out of 11 samples contaminated, while 7 out of the 8 samples that were tested of dragon fruit came back positive for pesticidal residue. The group is calling on Thai officials to reform the certification process, especially within the organic farm standard, which they say has also tested positive for pesticides. And today we'll leave you with scenes from today's vegetarian festival street procession in Phuket town, an intense day which saw several devotees pack the biggest temple in the municipality, the Jui Tui Shrine. From all of us at Phuket Extra, have a great weekend. Catch us on Phuket Extra Extra tomorrow, where we'll take a look at the top five stories of the week. Until then, stay classy, Phuket.
You guys ready? Yeah! yeah. All right, it's gonna be a tough one. Let's go. Ready, set, go. Nami's frozen yogurt is all about low sugar, low calorie treats with the flavors you love. Probiotic, delicious, and light. You can also enjoy Nami's on the go with our new Froyo truck. Nami is your sweet oasis with over 15 different toppings. Visit us on the Muay Thai Road, Soit Dayed, in Chilong. Media Nami's!